Three neat aspirants came to meet me yesterday. They asked me one thing, sir, we are giving our 100%. Still, we are not able to score well. Still, we are not getting the good results or the maximum results that we expected previously. I know maximum number of students watching this video would be facing the same problem. If yes, please do let me know in the comments if you are facing the same problem. Guys, let me just tell you, it is not only about the preparation or you are preparing for the need. It depends upon how you are preparing for the need. What is the plan you are actually following? It's not you are going randomly for, prepare, for the preparation of the need. And most importantly, it's not about how brilliant you are, how intelligent you are, how much you are able to remember. At the end of the day, what matters is the result how much you are getting in your mock test. If you are not able to score maximum, if you are not able to cross that mark which you are supposed to, then all of this will go into the waste. Because at the end of the day, we have to enter the medical college. If you do not enter the medical college, then why are you here? Why are you preparing for this? So for that, you will have to make a proper way, make a proper plan. And what are those steps in which you are lagging? And they asked me this particular question. Sir, are we lagging in something? Because we are giving our 100%. We are studying 20, we say 80, 19 hours. But still, 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 we are not able to score maximum. We are not getting the proper results. We are in a batch. We are doing this, we are doing that. But still, so that's the reason in this particular video, I will be talking about the topper's secret method. What is that secret method? which maximum number of toppers out there have followed previously so that they cracked this need and they entered the medical college. Okay, these are the simple steps. I know you guys are lagging. I know you guys are lagging at these points. But from now onwards, if you follow these, I give you the guarantee that you will not lag. Now listen to me very, very, very carefully. I would want you to focus over here. When it comes to the time we have for the 2025, it is very less, okay? And whatever the time remaining we have, it is gold, okay? You have to utilize it very efficiently. You don't have to go in a random way. Sir, I'll take that chapter. I'll start revising for this entire day. No, there has to be a proper plan. You'll have to make a proper plan, rigorous plan. I'm supposed to complete this chapter, that chapter, that chapter in this much amount of time. I, I'll have to solve 200 questions, 300 questions from this chapter, 400 questions from this that chapter, proper analysis you guys are supposed to do. That's what we call the serious plan. There's a difference between a proper plan, a serious plan, and preparing in a random way. No doubt, both the aspirants, this aspirant and this aspirant, he is studying for 18 hours, 17 hours, he is studying for 17 hours. But what is the difference between the two? He is following the proper rigorous plan. This the candidate is not following the proper rigorous plan. He'll get the good, good results. This candidate will not get the good results. Now, my dear friends, when it comes to that disciplined plan, I know you guys are neat aspirants. You guys are serious neat aspirants watching this video. So, so I can say over here, rigorous study circle or plan, we say 75% aspirants, serious aspirants are following this, okay? And that's for sure. So, and next we have effective revision plan. We say, we say, if there are, we say, uh, this is the category of the serious aspirants, we say 25% will be having the effective revision plan. So, what is this effective revision plan? Wait for some time, I'll be telling you what is the difference between the normal revision and the effective revision plan. How you guys are supposed to do that also. And then we have the master at analysis. If you are not master at analysis, I say you will lag for sure. Because I have seen students in my life that those neat aspirants, they are very good at concepts. They are able to solve the questions in the class. But when it comes to the examination hall, they lag over there. They don't get the good results. So this is one of the main reasons. That's why this is extremely important. I'll, explaining, I, I'll be explaining this also. Only 15% of those neat aspirants, serious neat aspirants are good at this. And that's the reason we say those are toppers who are good at this. Now, my dear friends, the very first thing in this particular case, the rigorous study cycles, rigorous study plan. You have to follow a proper plan and in which you are studying the lectures you are in. Let's suppose you are studying from a particular teacher. Like, 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 as of now, I would recommend you, that is the detailed one shots, which we are taking on this Unacademy Neat English channel. That is the, the game of Neat. 
because every single topic we are teaching in that every single problem we are solving in that and let me just tell you today today itself my dear friends i have i am taking this game of need i am taking the magnetism complete marathon and i'll be completing the two chapters today that is that is we say magnetic effects of current and and we say magne magnetism and matter so i would want you guys to go on to the channel an academy need english and hit the like button over here okay as soon as possible and and at 5 pm exactly i'll be starting this marathon in which i'll complete the two chapters okay every single thing i'll be teaching in detail with all the problems okay so the first thing is basically this one and then 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 next thing over here is we say whatever we teach over there whatever you learn from that particular those particular lectures you'll have to make the self notes okay you make the notes okay everything should be mentioned in those whatever the problems you have you mentioned in those ncert mastery when it comes to the biology and organic chemistry and inorganic chemistry and then we have the question practice in which you have the ncert pyqs and ex we say external questions okay now my dear friend my dear friends if you are already following this then it is completely fine as i told you serious 75% neat aspirants are already following this particular plan because we have i have personally shared this before also then comes then comes the effective revision plan these are the three things i am telling you in this one what was the first rigorous study cycle effective revision plan and master at analysis next we say chapter wise or unit wise revision when it comes to the revision plan first if you have completed the chapter you guys are supposed to do this do the revision of that particular chapter that's what we call the chapter wise revision and second is what we call the comprehensive revision that is full syllabus revision like i completed 5 to 6 chapters of 12th portion now you will have to do the revision of that and this revision should be target based revision sir what is target based revision first it sir i'll re start revising this chapter and i'll go for scratch 3 days 3 days i'm completing i'm 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 revising a chapter no no it has to be target based if i say you will have to or if you say i'll have to complete this chapter i'll have to revise this chapter by by 8 o'clock 8 8, 8 pm in the evening so it means that you will have to finish it by 8 pm and 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 most importantly time in advance that is finish before you know what the toppers out there do they first set up the time duration like i'll have to finish this by 8 pm then then they push the, themselves up to the limits and they finish this particular chapter by 6 pm only so that's what we talk up that's what we say we say finishing before the time and you will have to set the number of questions initially how many number of questions i'll have to solve along with this revision plan itself okay that should be basically defined in the initial process only okay and then afterwards we say the analysis once once you are done with every single thing you are done with that okay you are done with that once you are done with that so in that particular case means means you are done with this so then 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 comes the third thing that is what we call the analysis sir what is the analysis like you are giving a test you are done with the revisions now you go for the test i am supposed to write the test for that particular chapter for that particular portion in physics or chemistry or biology now if you lagging if you are lagging at some particular question you will have to do the analysis later on why did i lag exactly this is very much mandatory because maximum number of students they are good they are very good i would say at solving the problems but due to the silly mistakes they lag they, they lag over there or if you are not able to solve the pro problem from that particular portion you will have to do the analysis later on so that so that in the upcoming time you do not follow the same mistake over there okay so that you do not follow the same mistake over there now in that particular case we say identify the weak areas you will have to basically identify the weak areas okay and then then you will have to push your limits you will have to push your limits and even even i would say this analysis you guys are supposed to do after the test also and this analysis you guys are supposed to do in the revisions also if you are lagging in some portion over there you will have to do the analysis why did i lag solve multiple questions and on that uh, topic okay so you'll have to identify the weak areas and then you have you'll have to push up to the limits push your limits okay so that so that you can basically score maximum and this will basically build the confidence in you that's for sure because i have seen students previously who did this who did this after solving after after gaining the good control on those topics which they were bad at then then 
they, we say they build the confidence, okay? Then, then, then the ultimate secret is basically motivation. The first thing is mentioned over here, toppers never run out of the motivation. They are always motivated because their goal is one thing that is the selection. So every single thing, whenever, every single time, whenever they get demotivated, they remind of one thing. What is that? That is the wearing that white coat, entering the medical college in the upcoming time. So that gives the motivation. So toppers find motivation in small, small things. Toppers don't stop. So my dear friends, follow this particular plan. Follow this cycle, which I told you, study cycle. With the game of NEAT that we are basically starting, uh, that, that we have already started, you can join that. Today in the at 5 p.m. exactly, we'll be starting the Magnetism Marathon. I would want you guys to join and smash the like button over there as soon as possible. And, and smash the like button on this particular video and do share it with your friends. And one more thing I just want to tell you in this case, that is, that is, that is, that is. We have a Phoenix batch that is going on. We have a Phoenix batch that is going on. You must be knowing, okay, okay, and, 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 and. So this Phoenix batch is basically by Team Avengers, every single, single thing. We say, see, when it comes to the YouTube, we teach the content very efficiently. But then apart from that, you'll have to give the tests. Apart from that, you'll have the proper mentorship classes, proper mentorship sessions, okay, okay. So that is available, study material, that is available in this new 2025 batch, Phoenix match. If you have not enrolled as of now, so enroll as soon as possible. The link is in the description below. Click on to that link and, and you can enroll over here. Okay. Okay. So that's all for today. That's all for today. So thank you so much, guys. Take care and bye-bye. Make sure you hit the like button. So see you guys at 5 p.m. today. Take care.